Okay, foresters, we are propagating our passion fruit. Um, so we cut a chunk of the vine off and we want to take it at the first node and we want to cut just below the first node. The node is here where the uh, leaves come out. This is where your roots are going to come from. And what I do is I cut the stuff off the leaves off the first two nodes and then the third node I will cut right above it. And then I cut all these little extras off. And now we'll let Amy show you. So this is the top part. There's the middle node and then the bottom node. And I'll show you again on this one. We go right below the node, cut it, and then cut the leaves off that node this. and then the next node up. Mm -hmm. And then I go cut above the third node And there we are. And then what we do is we come over here to the soil. And we got our pots with soil in it already. And then I'll just take my finger and make a little hole in there. Push this in, tamp it around nice and tight. And do the same with the other one. And then this will go in with our other cuttings. And we're going to put this, if you're anywhere up north or anything like that, these things need a lot of humidity and they need shade. You don't want them out in the sun. They'll burn if they're in the sun. So we're going to take and put these underneath our oak tree. We're in the middle of summer, so we're not worried about humidity here in Florida. We'll have plenty of humidity, but uh, they'll go in the shade, in the dapple shade, and these will eventually take root, and then we'll be selling these later on. Just a few more to go, and all from the Tunnel of Love. <laughs> oh, I heard a uh, passion fruit fall. I think we got another one. Okay. I'm going to see if I can find it. Well, I don't see it anywhere. Oh, yes, I do. There it is. Oh, oh, it's rotted. That's okay. <laughs> yeah. Oh, there's a couple over here. There's more now. I bet you these are the ones that we've been that have been fallen. Yeah. We'll have to wait till we can get um get to them. That we, one looks good. That that one's rotted over there. Yeah. But the there's a two or three right here that look good. There's another one. Yeah, but is it ready? Yeah, that's a good one. It'll it's starting to turn. Oh look, there's another one up there, a red one. Don't shake it. No, don't shake the tree mm -hmm. <laughs> when I'm under it. I don't need to get hit. <laughs> oh, I heard one fall over yeah, here. That's a rotted one, though. Oh. Got stuck up in the thing. All righty. So. Oh my God, the dogs are barking and they can hear you. <laughs> oh, man, this one's beautiful. That one is. Let's see. Nice. Toss these up on the porch. Yeah. All right, guys. So that's what we're doing to uh, get our uh, deck ready here. So and this is what we got so far. All right. Got the passion fruit vine up. 
got the well, he, he tire. Yeah, it's almost dug up. Yeah. But uh Donald's gonna do his thing. His muscle thing. Ooh, that was a big root. Well, that kept it. That tire kept that thing nice and dark. Yeah. Oh, there's a nice worm right there. Grab that. We're we'll about to grab that worm. Put it I'll in put with it. Put a bunch of worms in here. Oh, there are we're a lot. Yeah. <laughs> nice. Where are we gonna be, uh, plant this one? Over by the oak tree. Okay. I'm gonna try to plant both of these to see if we can get them. All right. To take root. I don't know if they'll survive or not. Well, it's worth a shot. All right, so we are in the duck pen. And uh, planting it. We're just setting it on the ground. There's some passion fruit in here too. Okay. That I'm hoping will rot, seeds will germinate. Germinate and we'll have new ones. Now I'm going to go down there and get some of the duck pond dirt. Duck pond dirt? That's over here. We started taking the uh, Yeah, I'll hold the flags up for you. I hold the flag. I hold the flag. Up pine here. <laughs> yeah, but they make really good nesting. The ducks yeah, love it. The ducks like it. Yeah, the ducks actually like it. And when I have the chickens in here, the chickens <laughs> like to roost on the thing. So I figure right now it's not a priority. So we'll just run with it. All right, so story on this is that um what is that? Dad, what is that is don't kill it is that a eel yeah no no uh is that a newt it's some kind of legless lizard here i'm gonna give you the camera i got gloves on it's rolling Oop, it's rolling oh slippery it's got, it does have... Yeah, that's some kind of newt. That's a newt. Let's put it back in here. Okay. Well, I gotta catch it again. Wow, he digs fast. <laughs> come here, guy. Come here, come here, come here. Okay. Oh, my God. Okay. Yeah, put it's him back. It's almost like a catfish. Yeah. But that's there's his little legs. Yeah, toss him back in. Just toss him out there in the center. Is he going to be able to dig in there? He should be able to. How about we dig in another hole? I'll All right. in this one. That way he can at least get himself recovered. All right. Hold on. I'm going to cover him up. Hold on. I don't want the ducks and everybody finding him. Okay. Here we go. Uh, hold on. Let me take my glove off. I don't off. know how good I videotaped that. I was too busy watching it instead <laughs> of videoing it. Uh, that's okay. We got a good... Uh, yeah, so... We're going to dig in another hole. Anyway, we started digging this uh, duck pond area for the ducks, as you can tell. Now, the water drains into this area from the road. And it goes all the way back to the next neighbor's property out there. This is why the ducks have such a large area because it does get flooded. And here, this dirt is nice and rich for one. 
and then two well wait, wait that's where the newt's at be careful yeah it's over to the side though i know well start digging around like this way but um so we uh we take the dirt from here and even though this pond was what you got it about two feet deep yeah it keeps filling it in. keeps filling in so that just goes to show you all the settlement that comes in here but it makes for really good potting soil for when we need to use plant something, something and plant something so that was gonna fill up the wheelbarrow a little bit and then we're gonna go back to the plant all right now we're gonna put that nice black Whoa. dirt. Don't fall into the duck pond. Or that the duck, been funny that duck video. pool. Duck pool, I should say. Oh yeah, this should just fill it just perfect. That would have been hilarious on video. Yeah, it would. The water hose. Yeah, turn on, turn it on. Where are you spray it down? Well, it holds that water, doesn't it? Yep. <laughs> That's another good thing about that dirt. It does hold the water. All right. Nothing grows plants quite as good Actually, as I don't think it needs any more water. I want to get it all really? washed in around the, under the rim. Oh, uh, okay. But that's pretty much what will happen is then is the, um, the vine will produce new leaves and start growing up the tree. And this is one of our nice big oak trees. Um, and then when the fruit is ripe and ready, it'll just fall to the ground. And we're out here twice a day anyways. So any fruit that we find, we'll just pick it up and take with us. If the animals want to eat some, that's fine by us too. So are you chasing them? No, they just run from me. They don't like me. They don't My like feelings you. are hurt. Yep, I can tell. <laughs> All right, on to the second one. Yep. All right. We'll be back, guys. Behave. Ooh, you left that one long, didn't yeah, you? Yeah, I did that on purpose.
Oh, I saw it. Wow, this one's really in there, ain't it? Yeah, this one's the biggest of the two. Oh, look at that root system. I might have to hold that one when you're <laughs> carrying it. I think so. Gee whiz. That's got a nice little root system. All right, now we're gonna take some of the dirt with us. A lot of ants there, ain't there? Yeah, that's all right. The ducks will eat them. Those look, what are those, carpenter ants? Yeah. Or not carpenter, uh, the wood ants, aren't they? Yeah, those are carpenter ants. All right. Back over to the duck house, or duck pen. Oh, in the tire. I'm not worried about them. Gee whiz. Oh, it's getting windy again. Yeah. That hurricane. I think it's about ready to hit Miami. Oh, use that Use that old wire. We can hold it up. Twist that's, it around it a little bit. That's what I'm going to do. Oh, that's a good idea. Yeah, we. this wire. I guess they had some type of light out here, but the wire has grown up into the tree. So we're assuming there might be a light in the tree. <laughs> Somewhere. Somewhere. I'll be buried in it it's, right up in there. Yeah, I mean, I'll show you guys. And it's just coming out of the tree. So, it's a pretty big tree. But, hey, use what we got. All right. That's got a really nice root system. Yeah. For the duck dirt. Duck dirt. There we go. Under the flags. Over the river and through the woods. <laughs> And the door in the doors to my truck. Doors to your truck are open? I think the side door is, yeah. Okay. Just had to run. Hey, sorry, Rain. We got these feeder bands. So I had to go and shut up everything so we wouldn't get rained in our shed. Donald's work truck. And just like that, it stopped. So but the, that hurricane I, or the, the hurricane that starts with the letter I, all the feeder bands are gonna be coming from this direction here. So, let me go back to Donald. Okay, you didn't have any of your doors open on the van. Oh, I must have closed them, man. Yeah, that's okay. But I got the shed locked up. All right. There you go, we're planting this one and hopefully we'll get some passion fruit up the tree. This will be really cool. Ooh, you're all wet. 
Yeah, it rains. <laughs> <laughs> All right. On to the next chore after this. Hey guys, if you like that video, hit that like button. Remember that bell and subscribe. And if you want to see any of the other videos, check out everything over here.